Hi guys, FNAF Coolest 734 here, and today's the day that I'm gonna find the Black Light Security Breach plushies. So, um, let's start a hunt. Wish me luck, guys. Also, my nearest off topic is like two, two towns away, so, uh, yeah, um, let's go. Alright, we're finally here. Wish me luck, guys. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's, there's really nothing. I mean, there's there's some dread bear, but I don't think there's nothing here. Never mind, we found them. I found them, guys. I mean, there's there were no rocks at Wolf or anything, but at least I found Glamrock Freddy. All right, guys, Glamrock Freddy's inside the bag. When I get home, I'll review him. Which is the next clip, so see you there. All right, I'm back home. And here he finally is, and it's time to review the the Black Light Lab Rock Freddy plush. Honestly, he's pretty soft. He's actually really soft. Also, I know that I said that I hate this guy. Well, I mean, I don't hate him. I mean, I wish we got a glitch drop plushie, but uh, we didn't. But yeah, um, he's actually a really great Black Light plushie. I know it's a recaller, but it's honestly better than the old Lab Rock Freddy plushie. But yeah, it's like neon color, which is um, pretty nice. And I'm like the third YouTuber who reviews this, who reviews this plushie. The first one was Puppet Steve, the second one was Camp Funko Toys, and I'm the third one, and I feel happy. I'm the first plush tuber, while Camp Funko Toys is like a collector, not a plush tuber. So I'm the first plush tuber to review this guy, and I'm the third person to review this guy. So yeah, um, I'm pretty happy to to have this guy since not many people have him. So um yeah, let's look at the tag. So the tag is some um, sec actual security security breach tag instead of the old instead of the um old tag. So that's pretty cool. And yes, he's an on topic exclusive. In the back, it's the same as the, the, the topic tag here. It's, it's twelve ninety. Honestly, pretty cheap for a hot topic plushie. Let me get my Glamrock Freddy plush to compare him. So I got my Glamrock Freddy plush here and they look pretty different. I thought this guy was just a recaller of Glamrock Freddy but only like soft, more softer and a 3D bow tie but their head shape, it looks pretty different. Like my Glamrock Freddy plush, it has like a, like a long face. Well, the black light Glamrock Freddy um, has a squish face, which is honestly better. Because Glamrock Freddy's official game design, his head is like this. Well, I mean, it's still, f it's still missing the face feature, so yeah. Also, there, also Funko is remaking Glamrock Freddy too, so it won't look this stupid anymore. So yeah, this Glamrock Freddy will be rare now since Funko is remaking him. So yeah, um, get out of the way, you piece of trash. This guy wins. So yeah, I still need to collect, collect more black lights. I I only have the Glamrock Freddy. Like, I need Roxanne Wolf, um, Glamrock Chica, and Monty. So yeah, I don't know why they didn't they didn't make like a Vanny Neon plushie. That would have been great. But yeah, um, well not great since Vanny plush kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, um, this is the review of the Neon Glamrock Freddy plush, and honestly, he, look, he doesn't look that bad. So yeah guys, um, that's it for this video, and uh, I'm the first plush tuber to review him, and the third person to review him. And this is different, right back of the tag. It's now distributed by Franco UK, Australia, and Europe. I, I, I promise that, that the other tags didn't show that. So that's pretty cool, I guess. But now I'm ending this, ending this video, so um, goodbye guys, see you later.